the shoemaker and the elves long long ago there lived a shoemaker his name was adil his wife's name was sia one day adil was making shoes his wife entered the room she asked him why he was looking sad adil answered this is my last piece of leather we have no money left we will have to go hungry now sia said god will help us do not worry dear a sad adil went to bed when he woke up the next morning he got a wonderful surprise he called out to sia sia look a new pair of shoes cried out adil sia picked them up and said they are beautiful i knew everything would be all right Adil sold the shoes and bought leather with the money. He cut leather for two pairs of shoes that night. Then he went to sleep. In the morning, when he woke up, he found them stitched. The next night, Adil left leather for three pairs of shoes, then four pairs and so on. Every morning, he found the leather stitched into shoes. A few days passed. Adil and Sia began to wonder who was making the shoes they wanted to thank their invisible helpers so they decided to hide behind the door that night and find out who their friends were that night they saw five elves come in dancing and singing the elves sat down to work and stitched all the shoes as they worked they sang we are the five busy elves we like to help Anybody in need, because we believe that everybody should have enough to eat. The elves finished their work and went away. Adil and Sia came out from behind the door. Sia said, "Such kind, wonderful little people. I will make them some clothes as a thank you gift." And this is what Sia did. The next night, the elves were delighted to find five sets of new clothes in place of the leather. Happily, they put them on and danced out of the shop. Adil was happy. He did not need their help any longer.